Yo, what's going on everybody? This is Loxy. Um, back for another little Tech Tuesday. Um, I want to show you guys one of my favorite reverbs. Uh, it's put out by this company called Audio Damage. Uh, right here, Audio Damage. And it's called the EOS Reverb. And it looks like this. Um, I threw it on my snare. This is just kind of like a record that I was working on. And um, I'm sorry, I put it on the clap. And I'm gonna kind of show you the difference uh, as to why I use this and why it's so easy and why I enjoy it. I mean, obviously you can use reverb on anything, on vocals, drums, um, synths, uh, melodies, chords, whatever you want. Um, it's all about like the way you use it and you don't wanna like overuse reverb um, to wash out your sounds and whatnot. But just to give it a little bit of vibe, it, it really, really helps. So. Um, I'm gonna kind of like start over with this one and show you what I did. Um, I think the easiest way for me to show you is just to uh, kind of isolate the sound. Um, so it's just a basic clap. Okay, so I'm gonna just throw the EOS on there. And when it starts, um, it kind of gives you a visual look of what the actual tail of the reverb is gonna be. And then there's also a pre-delay here. Um, I like to turn, like, take the pre-delay down so you can see the uh, milliseconds here. I just like to take it down to zero. Uh, it's just personal preference. And I usually use the plate too. Um, but I'm going to keep, right here is the, the dry and wet, so the mix, how much you're going to hear it. And right now it's fully extended. And again, it's super easy. You just shorten it or lengthen it. Um, this is what it sounds like without doing anything. Uh, let me put this back to where it was. It's about there, okay. So as you can hear, that's like, it's just way too much and the clap's not isolated, it doesn't have any punchiness anymore. So we definitely don't want that. Um, I'm gonna just process it a little bit while the loop is playing so you can kind of hear the difference. So take off the pre-delay. So a little bit better, okay. So now I'm gonna play it, you know, with the song, and I'm gonna I'm gonna play it first without the reverb. Now I'm gonna turn the reverb on. So anyways, as you can see, it, just, it really brings um, the clap to life and it definitely um, gives your, your record some vibe. Um, you can also put it on like an auxiliary channel and you can control it here, um, you know, on the front end, uh, the parameter, the, the dryer wetness that you want. So you could put something like this on the back end on one of the return channels, it'll show up over here and then you can kind of like, you know, adjust the amount that you want it to come through uh, and you can I mean, it's it, it's really really cool. You can uh, you can adjust the attack, the the rate, the depth, the diffusion. Um, all of these parameters are completely, um, you know, easy to manipulate. You pretty much just put the mouse on it and then just drag, you know, left, right, up, down, whatever you want. And um, you know, it's it doesn't take up a bunch of CPU power. It works really really well. Um, yeah, man, I love it. I use it on all my tracks. So hopefully you guys can use this. Um, Again, it's made by a company called Audio Damage, and it's called the EOS, and it's just a reverb. Um, actually, just got to give a little bit of credit to my buddy Brian Matrix. He put me onto this um, plugin. Me and my uh, production partner David, um, he put us onto it. I want to say it was uh, about a year and a half ago, um, maybe even longer, but I'm um, just super great, and I've used it kind of on everything. So. I'll try to put a link uh, down below in the comments uh, so you guys can access it and grab it. Um, and uh, yeah, man, uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this and can use it. And um, we'll have something coming up uh, next week as well. Sorry for last week, I couldn't post anything. I was just crazy with Memorial Day weekend and traveling. I wasn't able to get back in time to do it. So wanted to get something good for you guys this week. All right, man, I'll see you guys next week. Later.